This is literally my setup. It's just a small cooler right here. And I opened that up. <clears throat> and I just took them out of the bag because I wasn't going to record anything. But here I am. So I keep everything in this bag to keep it clean and whatever. And these are my shields, my brush shields that fit into my bra. And there's the little hole for the tubing to go into. And you literally, I, I, what I do is I put some of this, whoopsies, um, I put some of this on each of my nipples and then I put these on and then my tubing is right here, right here, right here, baby Buddha tubing. And then the, this piece just fits right into the shields, like I said. And then the other part, which has the little connector piece on it, fits right into the Baby Buddha pump, which I have right here in the front zipper portion to keep it separate from all the liquid stuffs along with the charging cable. So here is my pump, the size of my cell phone in my hand, super duper awesome. It's got a lanyard to hang around my neck, so it's portable and I charge it after like three uses, which is at the end of my work day, because I pump once in the car, once on my lunch, and then once in the afternoon. And you can turn it on, and it's got the letdown feature, and you go as up to five or whatever. And then you could click on it, and it just has the slow, like letdown, I forget the name of the selection, but yeah, and it, that goes up to nine. Anyway, and that goes up to five. Um, so that's my pump. I keep my storage bags, my nipple balm, my marker to write on the bags for the date and the ounces. Hand lotion, because my hands are always dry. And then these wet ones, which I still haven't used, but they're there. And hand wipes, because I've got um, hand sanitizer and a container of Lysol wipes at the desk that I use to pump at. But And then this is to like Whenever I take these off, I always have milk on my breast still, so I use that to wipe off, and then at the end of the week, I change that out for a new one. <clears throat> but that's my setup. So this is me pumping right now. I'm pumping in the car, and I'm about to leave somewhere my baby Buddha pump and my free me cups that um, I feel like they make me look like Madonna. But it is what it is, and... I pour my milk into a plastic bottle to see how many ounces it is exactly because even though these cups are marked with the ounces, it I feel like isn't exactly accurate. But to get the same measurement each time, to get the same measurement each time, I pour it into a baby bottle and then from that bottle I pour it into a plastic bag and then label the bag. And then I take my cups and the bottle and I put it in my Ziploc and then put it in the refrigerator and then pull it back out in my next break and then my lunch and um, at the end of the day I go home and I'll take them out of the bag and I'll turn that bag inside out and wash it with soap and water and then wash my pump parts with the bottle brush um, and then I set the bag and my parts on the drying rack and then reuse it all the next day and I do replace the plastic bag once a week um, just because I feel like it gets I don't know personal preference there's my milk baby fed before I left so there's not much there so let's see how much is here do a double take there's always a little bit more at the bottom okay and I don't have time to bag it so I'm gonna put this bottle in my in my little cooler in my bag until my break so I have time to, to bag it up but I mean wow I got a four ounces after he ate this morning so that's pretty good and it just sits in there like that. I got the two in my bottles, actually not in the bag, it's just sitting separately. Okay, this is my setup at lunch. I just got my, my lunch stuff here. I got 
my hand sanitizer, my uh, Lysol wipes, my tissues, because I use tissues to wipe off any extra milk that might have spilled over inside this bag. I'm gonna put this milk in a milk bag and then eat my lunch while I pump. Super fun stuff. This is literally my setup like every day. <laughs> this is, um, I just got done wiping it off so you could tell that it was in the refrigerator because there's condensation and whatever and it's gonna be a little bit cold but when it's time to pump that coolness feels good. So I'm about to apply some of my balm, whatever. I just wanted to add, it's also good to have this once you put on the, the balm because then you can use it to wipe your finger off of the extra balm. <laughs> All right, I just dated it with today's date, which is March 9th of 2020. There's four whole ounces in there, which is good for a whole bottle. Um, I got my pump set up going on right now. Let's see, Yay, and actually, I'm gonna turn that up. I usually wait for it to get to five, but um, in the letdown mode, and then I switch over and do a level six under this mode. I'm not sure why. Six is just comfortable for me. It does have a stronger suction than like the Spectra S2, which is um, really gentle, which I use that Spectra S2 during my first um, breastfeeding journey with my first son. And then I discovered this thing because it's completely mobile. Like I'm not attached to the wall. I can get up and walk around if I want to. Super, super um, convenient. So. so hey, this is my second break. I had my lunch earlier and then I just get to sit back here in the back room and do my second pump. My third pump for the day, but my second pump at work. So I pump on the way to work in my car. I pump it my lunch and then I pump it my afternoon break and it's still just you know I look like Madonna and whatever but like I'm in the back room of the nurse's office and that's it I mean I take my break I'm gonna bag up this milk right here because um, I got four ounces on my way to work and I got another four ounces during my first morning break so we'll see how much I make this break probably going to be like three ounces honestly because that afternoon break is a lot less usually than the first two um but I love this baby Buddha because it's got a stronger suction than my Spectra S2 and the I don't know I just really like it and I, I, I will warn that excuse me I was just adjusting it um I will warn that the baby Buddha can be a little shockingly strong with the suction if you're not used to that um, because it is what's that right word it is stronger than a uh, spectra I got my bottle well I got that you can't flip the camera around once you're on selfie mode so I have I have my can I see what I'm doing here got my bottle that I'm gonna get one of these bags out these lay flat when they are frozen. So these have been my recent bags. I have another brand that I use that I haven't bought more of since I've had these. They were given to me by a friend. And my little marker here. But I don't have a stand for my camera, so I'm gonna bag it up and then put it in the refrigerator. Good luck, mamas. If you have any more questions, I'm here for you. Like and subscribe. Have a great day. Bye.